For the past three years, I've been photographing nearly every storm that passes over my house. And in that time, the results have been incredible. was my last full year before I go to college. I'm not sure what the channel will look like then. This video is the last of its kind, presenting the storms of 2023. Usually, I start these videos in March or April, but in 2023, there was already thunderstorm activity in early January. This is a photograph of a storm cloud roughly 100 miles away. At the time of this picture, this storm was producing this tornado in Illinois. February 22nd would bring another squall line type thunderstorm. Unlike the last one, this storm was starting to rotate and a tornado warning was introduced. I was at school during the storm and was unable to photograph it. No tornado occurred. On March 31st, the Storm Prediction Center issued a rare high risk of tornadoes in two areas, and a moderate risk in my location. Though over a hundred tornadoes touched down that day, I didn't get any severe weather. However, I did get some pictures of the storms as they passed through.
July 29th, a wall of cloud loomed in the distance. This wall of cloud was actually a long-lived, powerful squall line approaching my area. By early September, storm activity had quieted down, and the thought of a significant storm became more reserved for next year. I must admit, I was not expecting 2023's grand finale. Oh my gosh. 